Biloxi is honoring those who gave their life for this country. This Memorial Day weekend, flags will be placed on veterans' graves at the National Cemetery. And you can also help. Leslie Rojas joins us live from Biloxi with more. Good morning, Leslie. Good morning, Lauren. You are correct. Over 27,000 flags will be placed on each veteran grave. Uh, there's volunteers gathering right now. The ceremony does start at 9, but here with me is volunteer Terry Tyler, who's going to let us know um, why she's volunteering here today. Good morning, Terry. Good morning. Um, just tell me a little bit of who did you come here with? Um, I'm here with uh, our sorority, Zeta Phi Beta Sorority Incorporated, along with uh, the D9 and the Mississippi Greek Weekend. And there's a lot of you guys here. Yes, ma'am. There's a lot of the uh, fraternities and sororities. We come every every year to uh, serve our community. And um, this is this event is a little special for you because you have your grandparents and right. some of your family members here. Yes, my grandparents are here. I have um, uncles and aunts who are also buried here. So um, this is special for me also. And do you get to place those uh, flags in your family members' graves? Um, usually I do because I know where they're buried, so we go over to that area. But um, last year I didn't. But um, it doesn't matter because, you know, I, I like representing the f um, family members who cannot come out to place the flag, you know, on their um, family member's grave. So if it's my grandparents or, you know, whoever, I'm honored to do it. And Terry, for people that have not been here uh, during the ceremony, when people go out and mm -hmm. place those flags, would you recommend them volunteering? Oh, yes. And then you get to meet people. Um, you're doing something, you know, for your your community to honor, you know, the people who are here. So, yes, I do recommend to come out. And um, it, it's just a good feeling. And you heard it from Terry. If you want to come volunteer, you still have time because the ceremony does start at 9 a.m. Live in Biloxi, Leslie Rojas, WLOX News Now.